Hello and welcome to Grand Theft Auto Online Mission Tutorials. In this first episode we're covering Potshot, a very easy mission that can be completed solo in under 3 minutes and earn yourself $7,000. So to get this mission you'll need to be at least rank 25, well not really you, just whoever's hosting the mission. So if you don't know how to host a mission without having it requested, you press start, go to online, jobs, host job, Rockstar Created, Missions, and then choose a mission from the list. In this case, we're doing Pot Shot. So once you find a host who's level 25, then you can go ahead and start up this mission. You can do this mission with up to four players, however I do recommend doing it solo, or with one other player. This mission is probably the easiest, quickest method to make money playing solo, because it only takes three minutes to get yourself $7,000. Now when you first spawn in, as you can see, I'm on like this dirt road next to the highway. And I don't have my personal vehicle spawn in there, so I just go down on the highway and pick the biggest, strongest, most durable vehicle you can find. So an SVU, an RC, a van, anything that's big and can stop a regular van, okay? So then what I want to do is drive over to the destination marker, as you can see I'm doing now. And once you're there, there'll be two guys guarding the bridge. Now what you have to do is kill these two guys, and hopefully someone then will get into their van and try and escape. What you need to do is block off that bridge so that they can't escape. I do not recommend going onto the bridge to block it, because if you do that sometimes it can stop the guy trying to escape, and uh, the game thinks you're coming to kill him so he doesn't bother trying to escape. So don't go on the bridge, just block off the bridge with a car right in front of it and hopefully he'll come and get you. If you want, you can get out of your vehicle and then use a shotgun to insta-kill him. However, I feel like using a micro SMG and shooting him straight from the car is better. Because then you don't have to get out of your car, kill him with a shotgun, get back in the car, drive your car away, get out of the car, get in the van. It's just a long process and honestly, doing my method is a lot easier and quicker. And what you do is just stay in the car, he rams into you, you shoot him with an SMG, Move your car or van, anything out of the way, to get into the van, and then you have an easy path then to go back to Trevor's trailer and get yourself the money and the RP. There'll be no one in your way because you've obviously already moved your vehicle and you don't have to get in and out several times. And honestly, from doing this mission several times over, this is the quickest method I have found. So thank you for watching my first episode of Grand Theft Auto Online Mission Tutorials. More in the future. And uh, if there's any missions you're finding difficult and you would like me to do a tutorial for the best, quickest and easiest ways to complete it, then I will if you leave it in the comments below. Thank you for watching, I hope you enjoyed, and goodbye.